Today I'm going to show you how to play PlayStation Plus games by streaming them to your Windows PC. According to the PlayStation website, here's what you need to get started. A PlayStation Network account with registered payment details. If you have a Sony PlayStation console, you already have one of these. A DualShock 4 wireless controller or other compatible controller. That's right, a DualShock controller, not a DualSense controller like you'd use with your PS5. An active PlayStation Plus Premium subscription. Premium is the highest tier on the newly relaunched PlayStation Plus service, and also the most expensive. But if you want streaming access to this catalog of games, it's the only way to go. You'll need an active broadband connection of at least 5 megabits per second. Since you're streaming these games and not downloading them, the faster the better. And you need to be 18 years or older. There's not much I can do about these last two, but if you need help with the rest, you're in the right place. So let's get into how to play PlayStation Plus streaming games on your PC. The first thing you need to do is download the PlayStation Plus app. There's a link to the page where you can download it in the description for this video, or you can find it at playstation.com ps plus. Scroll down to the section that talks about cloud streaming and click find out more. Now click on the button to download the PC app. When that's finished downloading, open up the installer and follow the prompts. When you're ready, click finish and launch the PS Plus app. When you open the app, Sony takes the opportunity to remind you that you need a PlayStation Plus premium subscription to stream games from the cloud. You can click learn more to see the benefits of the premium tier, which also includes time-limited game trials and access to the classics catalog of games. This is also a good place to sign up for PlayStation Plus if you haven't already, or upgrade to premium if you have an existing subscription. Head back to the PS Plus app and click the sign in button at the top. You have another opportunity to create an account here, but go ahead and enter your PlayStation Network login ID, password, and two-step verification. And there you go. Now you've got access to all the streaming titles on the PS Plus platform. The next step is to connect a controller so you can actually play these games. Right now, the streaming app only supports the DualShock 4, like you'd use with the PlayStation 4. This should also include any off-brand PS4 controllers, but I haven't had a chance to test that out myself. The easiest way to connect the DualSense 4 is with a USB cable. If you'd rather go wireless, you need a Bluetooth dongle that works with the DualShock 4 controller. Sony used to sell one, but they're very hard to come by, so I tried out the 8-bit Do Wireless Adapter 2, and it worked great. I was able to connect my controller directly to my PC via Bluetooth, but the PS Plus app didn't recognize it as being connected, but the dongle solved that problem. When your controller is connected, you can use it to navigate the app interface by clicking this button up here. Or you can continue to use your mouse and keyboard to find the game you want. Unfortunately, you can't use the keyboard and mouse to play games. I'm more of a console player than a PC gamer, so that's not a big deal to me, but I can see a lot of people being frustrated by that omission. The PS Plus app doesn't support the PS5's DualSense controller either, but if you wish you could use either of those other controller options, there are emulators available online that you can try, but I haven't tried them yet myself. Let me know in the comments if you come up with any other creative controller options that work with the PS Plus app. But now it's time to actually start playing some games. The PlayStation Plus app offers a ton of titles, from current-gen PS5 games all the way back to the original PlayStation era. When you find one you like, select Start, and soon your game will be ready to play. When you're in a game, you can press the PS button to close the current game, manage your save data, and access vibration settings for your controller. Depending on the game, some of the controls may be different than you're used to. Older games may ask for the start button, which you won't find on the DualShock 4, but pressing the touchpad usually works. So that's all there is to setting up your PC to play PlayStation Plus games in the cloud. It occurred to me that this could be a great way to play some excellent PlayStation games without ever buying a PlayStation console. So if you're still having trouble finding a PS5, at least this is an option. And of course, the premium tier provides access to tons of older games that you might want to revisit, but are having trouble getting your hands on. Let me know in the comments which games from yesteryear you'd recommend. I usually like adventure games like Horizon Zero Dawn or God of War, but I'm willing to try any of them now that I have my premium plan. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.